What's going on everybody? In today's video, I'm going to be going over how to record data logs, save your data logs, and upload a tune on Honda K Pro. So it's pretty straightforward. We're going to go ahead and get into it. The first thing I like to do on any car is you're going to want to save the base map that is on your car before you tune it. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So basically you're going to want to come up to the data log button, click that, download from ECU. You're going to go to Calibration Storage, Retrieve Calibration. I have a different tune pulled up, so I'm going to click No. So basically now I downloaded the tune that is on the car. So you're going to want to go ahead, click Save As, and just save it as Base Map. This is my daily, so... I'm gonna save it. All right, so now your base map saved. So now that we have the base map saved, I'm gonna get into how to do the data logging part. So basically you're just gonna have to have your cable plugged in from the ECU to your laptop. And once that's done, basically you can go ahead and get to it. So this works for having the car off and starting the car, cruising, power pulls. You're gonna have to do this method, so. Yeah, all you're going to have to do is there's a little red button up here. I'm going to turn my key on. And it's this little red button. You know, you can either start it with the car off and it's running. Let me go ahead and start it. And it's going to record everything the car is doing. So you see it and moving the lines. It's recording. So let me go ahead. Every time you rev it, it's data logging. So this works for cruising, power pulls, all that. This can also be used for diagnostic problems you're having with the car, whether it's rich or lean or having ignition cut, all types of issues. It's, it's, it's a very well used tool. So we can go ahead and stop that. Once that's stopped, you can actually come back, drag it through your data, and up here is gonna move because you recorded your data from when the car was running. Now the car is obviously not running. Tell I did it with the car off. You can also do it with the car already running. Say you're getting ready to pull, do a pull. Right before you go to do a pull, you wanna click your little red button up here. Click it, make sure your timer's counting and it's recording. Go ahead and do your pull. Once you get done the pull, you turn it off. And now I'm gonna show you how to save it. So same thing, you're gonna go up to data log and then you'll see save as. And you could just do pull one. Hit save. And now your data log is going to be saved to the desktop or wherever you saved it. So you wanted to when you send it to your tuner or if you want to pull it up and look at it later, you click data log. Load. Pull one. Open. And then you'll have your data log open. So then your tuner can do what he needs to do, or you can go back and look at your data and see what the car is exactly doing. So now you did all that, you sent your data log out to your tuner, you received the new tune back. How do you upload that tune? I'm exactly gonna answer that for you. So I'm gonna turn my key on. We're gonna have the little lightning bolt so it's connected and showing all live data. You can go ahead to your tune file Make sure you grab the right proper one. I'm gonna open it, tunes open. And you just come up here, make sure car is not on, leave the key on. We're gonna click upload. It's gonna upload everything. Wait till it's done. Hear the relay cycle a couple times. Once all that's done, you're good to start it. So I always like to cycle the key off and you can cycle it back on and then you can start it. So one more quick thing I'm gonna go over in this video just while you guys are still here. If this is a new up and coming project, you don't have a tune when you come into data log, download, retrieve, and there's nothing here, that means there's no tune on the ECU. So you either have to reach out to your tuner and grab a base map or you can come up to new calibration, and then find whatever tune is closest to your build 
just say it's this one, click OK. Now the tune's pulled up, and you can click your little up arrow when the ECU is turned on. I'm not uploading this because I already have the car tuned on my tune. So that's just a method. If there's no tune there, that means there's there's no tune saved in the ECU. So you have to upload something or reach out to your tuner, and they can get you a base map made.